What's going on, everybody? We got our Com C in. I know it's been a few months. I'll show you what I picked up. But I did have one piece of the mail. I'm going to get the camera fixed real quick. Uh, if I seem like I'm a little beat right now, I was out doing yard work. So, yep. This one first card actually came in the mail. Uh, pick up John Elway. Refractor Auto from Finest. From 2000 Finest, as a matter of fact. PSA 9. I thought these were numbered, but I guess not. I might have been thinking about a different card. I thought these were like a uh, 10 or something, but I'm guessing I'm wrong because I don't see no numbering. But pretty cool card. I know Wildcat, you're liking this. Now there's football in here, Wildcat. All right, the rest is all calm C. Some of this stuff, I'll tell you, it was by auction or by what. This here was a buy it now. A uh, guy had it 50% off. We'll take Christopher Latang. Autos all day long. This is out of a peachy platinum. It looks like it's gradable too. Um, until I get a stack, it'll just go up into one of these for a time being. So pretty cool, Latang Auto. Do do do. Let's see. I'm gonna set these. All right. Up next, I know it's gonna be a lot of hockey. Jason Robertson SPX. If I can get to focus here. If I had this thing set for autofocus, oh, I guess I do. It's out 375. This is the true rookie jersey auto. So pretty cool piece there. Happy with this. Another one that somebody was just selling stuff. And I think I got this around 60% of what they were selling for. So again, really happy there. Pick this up. Allen and Ginter. Yes. It is football. Anthony Richardson. Don't see any autos of him running around these parts where I'm at, so these will definitely be hot commodities. I want to say I got like 40 or 50 bucks off of this when I bought it, so it wasn't too bad of a deal. Um, Using a lot of the lower end stuff that I've been selling to buy a lot of this. Next one was an auction. I got this really cheap, and I think the reason why it went so cheap, not because of the player. I know there's going to be somebody say it's because of the player. But it was up to like... I want to say 400 or something like that. And it just sat there. And I think everybody was waiting to the final seconds. Well, I went higher than everybody else and picked it up. Anthony Richardson Spectra Rookie Auto out of five. Again, I'm not holding this stuff very long. It'll be gone probably at the Midwest Monster. It's just stuff that I know I can move around here to get stuff. Uh, I'll show you some of the stuff that's coming up. This, I got another one. This was like... I bought it like 40%. I know, I know. It's CSG. I know. But I'm going to tell you what. Their 10s are very hard to get. For at least what I, I've seen. But I'll take it. OPG Platinum, McDavid Variation. So, good pickup there. One last CSG slab. I kind of like the CSG slab. The thicker ones, man, they are nice. I like them. Laffy Taffy or Lafreniere. However you want to say it. I still call them Laffy Taffy. This is the Black Diamond Quad Diamond out of 99. Thick card coming back as a 10. Hey. Take it all. The only thing I don't like, it's real loose in here. I don't want to shake it, but it, it's loose. One thing they need to improve on there with their slab. Otherwise, I like the way it presents. Up next, the next two cards I bought... A guy had them up at a sell price. And I want to say, when you add them together, I got them at 50% value. These are both single-digit PSA 10 pop counts. We're really hard. 94 Fleer. Fleer! Joe Montana PSA 10 in Chiefs uniform. So I think that one of these was like a, like a pop 7, one's like a pop 8. And next one's baseball. Ozzy Smith. I know I got corrected. It's the Emerald City. I don't know what I said earlier. I think Glass City or something like that. But the Emerald City. Wizards Uni. Another very low pop. Now you can tell this one here was just graded by the serial number. The other one here is a re-slab. I could tell. Alrighty. Two cards left, guys. Two cards left. This I picked up on auction as well. Gypsy Queen Ichiro Auto PSA 10. Couldn't beat it. I mean, it went like $100 cheaper than the other sales. So I said, hey, what the heck? 
grabbing it. Okay, so I had one of these cards here raw. I have a couple guys I know they're collectors, and I hit them up, said, "Hey, whoever wants it, just hit me up on PM with a price." Guy came back, and goes, "I'll give you 500." It's done. Added 20 bucks and picked it up at a nine. Big Ben SPX rookie jersey auto out of 375 in a nine. Those were really hard grades back in the day. Very, very happy with that there. So, did pretty well overall, Com C. The only keeper, I believe, is going to be the Big Ben. It's an upgrade. Um, I don't know. I have been thinking about moving stuff. Who knows what I'll do with it, to be honest, anymore. But those were it for one piece of a mail day. There was football, so I know Wildcat's happy now. Um... Whew, long day. I got up, uh, did the Salem card show, went around Bond. We'll talk about that in the next video, though. But other than that, guys, appreciate it. Like I said, Com C, you know, when you can find a whole lot of stuff that's cheap and undervalued, and I think by over time, you could turn that into profit and use it to buy better cards, sometimes at a good deal. Why not, you know? But that is it for me in this video. I appreciate you guys always watching it. I'll catch you next one.